this is sona d4 automatic stirrup bending machine now i tell you the the features of these machines uh, starting from here first of all we have two sets of payoff the payoff can have two turn of steel having uh, pre straightening wheels also so this is this will be supplied with two payoffs now from the payoff the rebar will be going into this pre straight pre straight wheels clamped with pre feed motor now this what what pre feed motor does is it feed to the traction wheels so we clamp the steel hair to assist the feeding of the rebar to the traction wheels instead of manual pre feeding i open the door of the machine so that i can show you the traction wheels also now what does that pre feed does is pre feed motor feeds to the traction wheels this is the traction wheels once the steel is here we'll clamp this and unclamp the pre feed motor now this have two sets of straightening wheels one is horizontal wheels it can uh, straighten the horizontal bends of the rebar then we have other set of straightening wheels which is for vertical uh, errors the traction wheel is having the power of 22 kw and here is the bending head which is having the power of 7.5 kw the cutting motor is having the power of 4 kw this is also being provided with hmi human machine interface so that you can command the machine air compressor is also supplied with the machine for the pneumatic controls such as air brakes of the payoff traction wheels and the mandrels coming in and out we also always recommend to supply this uh, servo auto automatic servo voltage stabilizer this is very essential component since you have to protect the machine vital electrical parts and electronic parts from the fluctuations and the spikes of the voltage so whatever be the voltage input the output will always be 380 volts and since it is automatic servo voltage stabilizer so you do not do not need any manual interface to uh, increase the voltage or decrease the voltage of any particular phase all the three phases are independently being rectified with this stabilizer now this is the electrical control panel of the machine having servo drives and a plc plc is the brain of the machine the bigger servo drive controls the traction wheel motor the smaller servo drive controls the bending let us demonstrate one piece of stirrup to you we have already fed a shape of a square 200 mm by 200 mm now here we can choose whether we want a single piece or a continuous motion continuous motion means you feed 10000 pieces the machine will keep on producing the stirrups and keep on counting those stirrups the moment 10000 is completed it will just switch off now i just try to make one here we go 